How about you? I'm Hank. Welcome to Hamiltonville Farm. I wanted to give you an update on a few things that we've done on the channel. Today, I want to give you an update on the dump truck that we had. Remember we sold the dump truck? Well, let me show you what's going on with it now. Man, don't that look different? Holy cow. The gentleman that bought the dump truck took the bed off of it and put it onto the dump truck that he had. This was the bed that was existing on the dump truck that he had. And so he bought the old International from my father-in-law, took the bed off of it, and then put the, that onto the new dump truck. And then he took the old, I don't know, maybe he's going to sell it for scrap or whatever. And over here, he's got the old service truck. That's the old Ford that they had. And then on the other side was the Chevrolet here. So they're going to do something. I'm sure they're going to take the service beds off there. But this is going to be a really cool video because we're actually going to go out and we're going to work on some heavy equipment. Going to do, I say work on. We're going to do some things with some heavy equipment, some excavators, and, and see some of the inventory that they've got at WRM Excavator Service. I'll link his phone number below. I'm telling you, what a good group of guys this company is. So I'll link their phone number. If you have any type of dirt work or excavation or or site prep then you can call WRM especially in the lower Alabama Panhandle of Florida area these guys will get to you anyway so stick around we're gonna go do that today it's gonna be a really really fun video especially if you like hanging around that type of big heavy equipment stuff I love it man I wish I could be around it every day all right let's go so me and Matt made it out here here's the bed on this old Kenworth dump truck. So this bed came off of the dump truck we sold to them. Now it's on this Kenworth and they're using it. I mean, they're clearing roads and they're doing all kind of cool stuff. It's good to see this thing living again. Matt, so, <laughs> how long did it take you to swap, swap that bed over? Oh man, it took us like one day to do the main part of the work yeah. and then another whole day of just knickknacks. Oh yeah. Getting it lined it up and all that. It so, fun. did you use an excavator to pick it up? <laughs> you didn't have four guys that could lift it up. And no, fall? no, we tried, but uh, <laughs> I mean, it was, was backbreaking work. So yeah. we not I hear you. I hear you. Hey, we're gonna take a look at some more of the stuff that he's got. It's going I'm already having fun, dude. We've been hanging out for about an hour, already having fun. So we're gonna go look at some more stuff that he's doing. But there she is. That's the update on the the, the dump truck here. Man, if only I had all this equipment. you imagine what we could do at Hamiltonville Farm? Maybe I'll talk Matt into coming and doing some projects for us here. So they're doing some road work here. So let's see what they're doing. So he's got that 85G buried, don't he? Look at that. We've had some heavy, heavy rains. And this thing is nothing but mud. So what they're gonna do is haul rock in here, fill that up. Man, that thing's buried. No. No? Not yet. <laughs> Not yet. <laughs> Still see paint? Yeah. yeah, I hear you. That is nasty.
There he goes, he got it. We're at the second project he's got going on here. Got the big 210G, that's a big old piece of equipment right there. Of course the 550's on this side. Watch him do a little work. He's hitting Clay there, it looks like. Sure, I don't get hit in the head with the, big, the bucket. That's just a little bigger than Ransom back of. Guys got it made. You get to work on these toys all day long. All right, here we go. I'm on. See what I can do to this machine here. Y'all stand by. All right, y'all are about to see my first attempt at driving a big old excavator. Let's let's check it out and see what we do here. Hold on. I want y'all think about that. Let me watch you dig this hole. I ain't digging a hole up here. Turn it over here. Skip it out a little bit. <laughs> oh man. I'll try not to. There we go. Let's see if I can bring it to me a little bit. Oh, that's not good. Down here. Skip it a little bit. Now bring it toward me a little bit. See if I scrape the top of the ground a little bit. Look at that. Oh, look at that finesse I'm doing. <laughs> oh. And I can. Uh, let's see. Uh oh, I forgot how to turn it. I forgot how to turn it back. There we go. Fill the hole in here. Listen. I almost got this thing figured out. Turn to the left a little bit. Get down here. Alright, let's see. Now, turn this up. Go back to the right. Dump it. Look at that, huh? <laughs> Man, I shouldn't be on this thing because I'm on. I'm gonna get addicted to it and then I'm gonna quit being, I'm gonna come out of retirement and start working for an excavator company. <laughs> this thing's awesome! All right, let me set this thing down. Let me 
rest that there before I tear off this <laughs> before I tear this machine up. Let me get out of here. That was I'm like a kid in a candy store, man. This is awesome. I don't know guys, you know, I, the only thing I've ever done is that little backhoe. This thing right here puts that backhoe to shame, don't it? Can you imagine? Man, I wish I had one of these at my place. Go up here. He's shy. He's shy. He didn't want to be a superstar. He didn't. <laughs> yeah. Here's an old 11 yard earth mover here. Yeah, that's crazy. So Matt, you're pulling dirt from down there up to here right with this yeah. thing yes we're filling in a filling an old hole right here yeah well, and this this thing hole to fill a hole. this is actually your newest newest member of the fleet huh yeah it's probably about the oldest too <laughs> we found a pretty good deal on it so okay. we decided to buy it we we're gonna buy an off-road truck but this come available so we decided to get it instead and see how it would work so yeah. far so good yeah that's awesome dude you gonna show me how it works yeah we'll run it for a little bit all right ten full in there and this thing don't crank i can come back and do a will it start video that's right <laughs> will it sit will it sit yeah fix that back here man that thing is huge it's a big old piece of equipment man I have to show you where I got stuck in up there where my boot got stuck in the mud. So that's one bucket. It's weird. It's pretty cool to see this stuff up close and personal. You know, you see it on the side of the highways and you see it on construction sites, but pretty neat to watch it up close and personal to see how the machines actually work. I'd have done. <laughs> if that was me doing that, I'd have done hit that. I'd have done hit that earth mover about 10 times with that bucket Look at that. I mean, that is just nasty. There he goes. Man, I'm telling you, that is nasty.
this is where we started the video, if you remember. So let's see what kind of work they've got done since we've been gone. These guys are working quick, you know what I'm telling. That looks great. Let's see if we can get a little closer look. Look. Nine day difference. He look like he knows what he's doing, don't he? This is that big old hole that you saw earlier. Man, what a great job they've done. Cool. Uh, now it's definitely passable. Really cool to see what you can do with the heavy equipment how much you can get done and how productive you can be with the right equipment you know you take somebody down here that didn't have the either the the resources and all they had was a tractor or a compact tractor or something man they spent days down here and these guys did it in a couple of hours you know hey matt thanks for letting me hang out today no dude. it was fun dude man yeah. are you going to hire me for the we'll see <laughs> I'll get back to me. I'll get back to me. Hey, listen, as always, there's going to be this little white circle over Matt's left shoulder. Click on that to subscribe. You can also watch more videos from us. Check out when Matt actually bought the dump truck over at my father in law's place. You'll like that video. Call 333 7450 to get Matt to come out and do some work for you. You guys take care. God bless.